Alright guys, this is going to be the first run of the uh, low C454 with the turbo head. I'm getting used to this starter box thing, so bear with me a little bit. out here. with me a minute.
definitely tell the difference between a sealed back plate and a full uh, stop. I hadn't even started tuner or nothing. I can't wait to get an over OC. That's just an OC 454. tracks though. sealed back plate on the start box. So let me fire it up again. I'll run it here in the grass. I don't want to run it on the pavement too much. So let me get it back on the starter box. That's one thing that I'm still getting used to is this damn starter box. But it seems to be working pretty good. So let me get y'all set up here. Tripod's working out pretty damn good tripod it's working out pretty good yeah all right that should be cool right about there let's get some running I don't know how much of that fence it's getting but
All right, guys, Old Faithful, TLR, Glow Igniter. Always works. is real tall. I'm 
probably should have the body on it, but I don't. I think I can definitely lean out the low end. You guys get the point man and uh, it's coming along but I can definitely tell the difference between a uh, roto start pull start and a sealed back plate there's a lot more power even with this stock 454 so uh, I don't know Father's Day is coming pretty soon I know my kids subscribe to my channel so uh, LRP 32 or Novorossi .288 just saying uh anyway i'll send you a link all right guys so let's go put this up real quick and uh starter box works well i think i just need to work on my endpoints. uh when i drop my uh my throttle all the way down um i think my my carburetor slide is not open enough so that's why it wants to die and that's why it's not starting on the box very well so I need to adjust uh, I need to do one I thought I was pretty close to one millimeter but the way I usually check it is with a paper clip um, I don't remember who showed me that I think it was Raja or someone showed me that paper clip is about one mil millimeter so uh, that's what I use I didn't use it this time so I think I'm, I'm closed a little bit less than that so I'm gonna work on that and uh, then I'll work on getting it tuned. Um, it's not running hot at all. I can just tell by touch, and I don't have my heat gun. But I mean, it's I can hold my hand on it, so it's got to be no more than 130, 140 degrees. So.